Hello everybody, back again, but I had to do this video as soon as possible. The new November 2022 Elder's Manual is out, and um, I'm sure lots will have it on social media. Thank you so much Atlantis for this information and also the November Elders Letters. Announcements and Reminders for November. For Elders, your Kingdom Ministry School, a document entitled 2022 Kingdom Ministry School Program for Congregation Elders will soon be posted in the forms section of the Documents tab when logged in to JW.org. Okay, Revised Shepherd Book, and then they have a list of revisions they have done. And usually most of us are just interested in chapter 14, which is about CSA. And it says, um, chapter 14, paragraph 8, inserted direction on what to do if there is potential for media interest in a case involving an accusation of child abuse. And then when you go to that section of the new elders manual, I'll read it. It's chapter 14 paragraph 8. The legal department will provide legal advice based on the facts and the applicable law if the individual who is accused of the CSA is associated with your congregation. The two elders calling should provide the legal department with the individual's full name, date of birth, and if applicable, applicable <laughs> date of baptism. After speaking with the legal department, the call will be transferred to the service department. If there is potential for media interest in the situation, the call will then be transferred to the public information department. Interesting interesting okay so they just have a long list like a page and a half of updates to the elders manual uh, release of JW hub website on November 14 2022 the home page that appears after logging in to JW.org will be named JW hub the site will use a new logo and website address they have the address here just hub.jw.org these changes will be visible to publishers who access such online features as my profile my applications and documents although the login link on the jw.org homepage will redirect users to JW Hub users will also be able to log in directly to JW Hub by navigating to the new website address Guidelines and forms that refer to using JW.org to access secure online features will gradually be updated to refer to using JW Hub. For coordinators of the body of elders, announcement for congregations, please ensure that the announcements for congregations are read at the next midweek meeting, thereafter posted on the information board for at least one month. And there's not much. There's like two paragraphs on the congregations announcements working safely at kingdom halls yep in connection with the cleaning and maintaining of kingdom halls we need to ensure that we eliminate or control risks especially from falls as soon as possible please arrange for a brief meeting with all elders and ministerial servants to discuss the importance of safety assign a care capable elder in your congregation there's also going to be a video, Jehovah wants you to be safe. Too bad your God Jehovah doesn't care as much about the children. There's also going to be forms in case there is accidents and all that fun stuff. For service overseers, um, there will be global effort to advertise the 2023 conventions. And you can request invitations already on Monday, November 28, 2022. Enhancements to JW.org literature feature. 
All right, now for the congregations, their announcement is Enjoy Life Forever videos. Um, book includes link to about 299 videos. A number of these are excerpts from existing videos. And uh, so when you study the book now, Enjoy Life Forever online, there's links to go to other videos. Fun. Jehovah's Witnesses have it so easy now. I mean, they don't even have to do anything, basically. Just, here, read this. <laughs> don't even have to give a presentation. Wow. Okay, expiring applications for your volunteer program. Be sure to update those. And that's about it as far as announcements. Nothing really earth-shaking that I read. But, um, anyway... And um, so anyway, I'm sure that social media will be having links to these elders book all over the place. And um, if anybody can't find it, I have the English one. So just email me at KimmyMBrooks at gmail.com. And I want to thank all of you for watching and liking and subscribing and we appreciate it we appreciate it very much and thank you for all the good feedback on under the video that was from our second channel and some phone calls so thank you we appreciate your positive comments and feedback it it, it really helps a lot it helps a lot so, love you all, and you have a wonderful evening. Bye.